When it was, I will just cut to the chase. When this was done, I was certain they had gone 30 minutes. And when I went back and timed it, it was only 20. I was flabbergasted. It was a boring ass 20 minutes. Um, quickly, is there a reason she came out with Hunter's old music? Is he coming back soon ish? I thought she came out to Bodies, didn't she? Was that no, really no she came back to Hunter's song. I, I mean, I don't know. Maybe they uh-huh. maybe this was on the network and they had to edit something else in or something. I don't know. No, they, they, used play, they Dude, yeah. this guy doesn't come back until January, so he ain't I coming see. back anytime soon. Yeah. Okay. The answer to your question is no. I don't know why they played her old music here. I guess maybe the maybe Bodies is now the ECW song, so she needs her own song. I want to uh, say they used Bodies in the very first thing on they, the show. They did. So they did. Do it, so doing it twice may have been redundant. Anyway. So she feels great. She's standing there talking about how wonderful she feels. She's like standing in a pool of Chuck Palumbo's blood. I swear to God. And I'm, and I'm watching her say this and thinking about this and thinking, imagine being Chuck Palumbo. Cutting yourself with a razor blade, bleeding all over the place for that. <laughs> like, I'd, I'd retire. I'd move on if I had something else to do with my life. <laughs> so Steph is there with Rhino. She wants to be in his corner at SummerSlam against Chris Jericho. Jericho appears, says Steph is a disgusting animal, and then proceeds to make fun of her breast implants. Shows before and after photos. Everyone's giggling. I love the idea that Stephanie is embarrassed that it is revealed that she has breast implants. Yes, yeah, she has. She went from like an A to a like an M, and okay. she thought we would notice. She and she flaunts them at every opportunity. She 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 paid thousands of dollars for a painful surgery to get her breasts enhanced. She then began to wear plunging necklines every week to enhance them in very tight, clean clothing to make sure we all knew her breasts were larger than they used to be. But now she is embarrassed. And (laughs) I'm sure there's... People are different. There are individuals out there with different reactions to things. But I can tell you that every woman I've ever met who has had implants done, not ashamed... (laughs) <laughs> no, you don't buy a new car and keep it in the garage. No, no. They're very proud. And they like to show them off and discuss yes. their details. So eventually Booker T interrupts. He calls Jericho both a woman and also a backstreet boy. Jericho calls him Mr. T. Eventually The Rock comes out and it becomes Rock and Chris Jericho doing open mic comedy night forever. The only highlight of this is that Rock actually said, and, and did not get bleeped, he called Shane McMahon a... Mother Vugga. Yes. Also Apparently, a pussy. That too. Yeah. So finally, Steph challenges It's possible them. that it was bleeped on the USA Network, and we just I got suppose. the unbleeped version here. I suppose. Steph challenges them to a tag match, and Rock does his catchphrase, and that's that. Again, 20 minutes long. It felt much longer. Now this I laughed at. Bro, this was the highlight of the show. What came next? Yeah, the hurricane. Steve Austin and Deborah are hanging out in their locker room, and in walks Hurricane Helms. And Hurricane is there to explain to Steve Austin that I was really motivated by that speech that you gave. And Steve Austin says, "Who are you?" <laughs> Hurricane goes, "I'm Hurricane Helms." Austin goes, "Oh yeah." He pretends like he knows who Hurricane is, and Steve Austin looks at him. And he goes. What is that? And Helm says, it's a tattoo. Steve says, well, I know it's a tattoo. What is it of? Deborah starts laughing when he explains. It's the green lantern symbol. And she's laughing. And Helm's like, why is this so funny? And Steve Austin looks at Deborah. Ha, ha, ha. He starts laughing. He looks back at Hurricane. He goes, who's a green lantern? And Helm says he's a superhero. Steve Austin says, well, that reminds me of Kurt Angle. And so him, Steve Austin, and the Hurricane start to discuss whether the Hurricane thinks that Kurt Angle could beat the Green Lantern. Yeah. The highlight of all of this. I'd love to hear this. Is the absolute sincerity of the Hurricane. As he's explaining that there's no way that Kurt Angle could beat the Green Lantern. Meanwhile, Steve Austin is so disgusted that this guy has a tattoo of a fucking fake superhero on his shoulder. He can't even believe his ears. I 
laughed. I watched this segment like three times straight through. I laughed so hard. Everybody was fantastic. Hurricane is fantastic. Steve Austin is fantastic. Deborah is fantastic. I loved it. And Steve Austin convinces him to d go try to take out Kurt Angle tonight. You didn't like this, Vinny? What is wrong with you? I, I didn't think it was funny. I didn't. It, Craig, it, it, back me up here. This was funny. This it was, was fucking great. This was a guy poking fun at the nerds at the comic yeah. book store. But he wasn't even poking fun because if you went into the comic book store, you would understand these people in the comic book store, right? Sure. Steve Austin cannot even comprehend that a person yes. would be so into a fake comic book character that they would tattoo his symbol on their shoulder. Austin is just burying his head as, as the hurricane is explaining all of this. It mm. was so great. Yeah, it's ridiculous to get a Green Lantern tattoo as opposed to like a Brahma Bowl tattoo. That's that's much cooler. Well, it is. <laughs> is it though? You know, I think Vinny was yeah. insulted. I, I, I think I would, that's a problem. I, well, yes. I, you I, were I, like, this Steve Austin, what a bully. Insulted the Green is, Lantern could be in, Kurt Angle. In, insulted is too strong, but no, the Green Lantern would kill Kurt Angle. Oh, now he's I see the magic, problem. He's a magic power Now ring. I see the problem. You're Gregory Helms. <laughs> Through brightest and day I'm and Steve darkest Austin. Night. No on, wonder now. I loved it. Yes, no wonder I hated it. I hated it. It's too strong. I was confused by it. Like, God, why is this an argument? It. I got it. Of that's, all the things that's... for Vinny to mark out for, in all these years we've been watching wrestling, the temerity, the temerity of Austin to disagree that the Green Lantern could beat Kurt Angle. Yes. And, and then Helms goes, he once, he once beat Superman. Yeah. One punch, he says this, and Austin's brain fucking explodes. <laughs> You're telling me that this, <laughs> this guy beat another? These two fake guys had a fight and one fake guy won? Who gives a shit? This is why you enjoyed this more than I did. You are Steve Austin. I'm I was Helms. totally Steve Austin. I'm Hurricane Helms. For this one moment. Deborah is telling Meat he should apologize to Steve Austin. Meat is unsure whether he should interrupt Austin in the bathroom. He's standing by the door. Austin slams the door open, apparently squishes Meat, and they walk away. Yes. You ever get your meat caught in the door? <laughs> no, Craig, I have not had my meat caught in a door. Hmm. Brian's had enough of the meat jokes. Dude, had a day of holes. I don't need to add meat in a door. Maybe you combine the two. Oh, God. <laughs> that was the worst visual I just saw right there, Vinny. <laughs> I'm not going to say what you just did with that mic. Yeah, I just, looked... Uh, really? No. I didn't yeah, hear that. Bad. All I did was put my forehead into it. Well. If you love these video clips... Head down there to the bottom right-hand side of the screen and click Join. For just $7.99 per month, you get full access to all of the episodes. Over 300 at current count. Full-length episodes of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, and Figure Four Daily with both Landstorm and Filthy Tom Lawler. You can also hit that subscribe button, and you'll always be alerted as to when new shows are available.